All right, everybody. Welcome back to Cooking with Corey. Today we're going to cook that perfect boiled egg with no greed on the yolk. Hopefully, we're going to try to get that done. We're going to make an egg salad. You know, it's nothing special, but it's going to be delicious. We're going to put a little jalapeno in it, a uh, little red onion, all that good stuff. Uh, bring it together. And uh, I'm going to try to use my new knife and hopefully I don't cut the tip of my finger off or shave a nail off. So you might want to stay tuned just for that because that could happen. That's next on Cooking with Corey. Alright, our ingredient list today is really simple. Uh, we got some celery, red onion, jalapeno, uh, eggs, some mayonnaise, some mustard, and some dill pickles. Then we're going to boil some eggs. It's going to be delicious. We'll see you back here. All right, people, to begin this journey, we got cold water in a pan. There's 11 eggs in there. There's not 12 because one cracks, so there is 11. So we're gonna roll with that. So cold water, pan, the eggs are covered in water, and we're gonna go to a medium high heat. We're gonna bring this up to a simmer slash boil. When it does that, we're pulling them off the heat, pushing them to the side, leaving that lid on for 15 minutes. Taking that lid off, we're gonna give them a cold ice bath slash cold water bath. And hopefully we get a nice yellow yolk. All right guys, we're back. Got the new knife. I'm a little scared of it. We'll see what happens here. So we're just gonna use some celery. Well, I still got my fingers. Don't want too big of chunks here. You don't want a whole bite of celery in your egg salad. Okay, so we did some celery. Let's move on to the jalapeno. There's off here down the middle. Now as you all know, your heat in your jalapeno is in all this white stuff and seeds, so we don't want this egg salad like super freaking hot. We just want it lit up just a little bit. In the meantime, my eggs come to a boil, and right when they come to a boil, I uh, took them off the heat. Obviously kept the lid on, so they're off the heat, they're going to chill for 15 minutes. And then we'll, we'll go from there on that. Obviously peel them and, and, and all that stuff we, we do to make egg salad. And then we'll chop up the eggs. I don't know exactly how hot I want to make this. Uh, probably not too hot because I'm not like it too hot. So nice smaller dies here on the uh, jalapeno. I would be faster with my other dies, but just a bit scared, like I said. All right, so that goes over there. This knife is heavy. It's really heavy here in front. It's, it's well balanced, but it's just heavy all together. I did. Um, so we definitely want to make a dice. So there's small dice because you don't want, you know, a big chunk of onion. I would. I mean, I did, dude. So go down. And then through. And uh, 
that's probably enough for the batch we got right here. And um, I don't know if I ever told you, but just make sure you're you're guided with this knuckle right here. So that should be bent over like that. I really can't grab it because it's not enough to grab. But right there, so so you're on there and keep this thumb, this thumb right here, he needs to be tucked back a little bit. Grab grab it back here. A lot of times I just grab it with my nail. But like that, and if you do that, like this, I know you can see my thumb there, but trust me, it's back for my, my front knuckle. And you go like that, you're good to go. So hey, look, my drive fork's done. I have not cut a figure off, tip of a figure, or shaved one of my fingernails off, which I've done before when I was a chef. I, I actually done it twice. Stories. All right, guys, here are eggs in the sink after I gave him a nice cold water bath for about 10, 15 minutes. There they are. Delicious. So I'm getting the process of peeling those. And when I get them all peeled, I'll bring you back. All right, bring you back. Just gonna peel real quick. Alright, we're going to reveal here in a little bit if I actually got yellow yolks, no green yolks. I haven't checked yet. We'll see here in a bit. Alright guys, this is moment of truth. I got them all peeled, only 11 of them. A couple of them were not agreeing with me, but we got them all done. So, here we go. We're going to see how we did. And I'll tell you what, perfect. Now how you do this, which I've already told you, is you start in cold water, it's in cold water, bring it up to right when it starts boiling with the lid on it the whole time there. Keep the lid on it, pull it off the heat, wait 15 minutes and cool your eggs down. I don't care if it's in a water bath. I don't care if it's uh, running cold water over. This is how you do it. That's a perfect hard boiled egg. No green at all. Look at that. She's as yellow as she'll be. All right. I'm going to chop these up and we'll mix it up and uh, we'll be back here in a bit. All right, guys, we are back to finish off our egg salad. We have did a really, really, really good job on our hard boiled eggs. There is not a green in a nether. So, this pile of, of veg we've done. I did some uh, dill pickle while, you, while I was off camera. So let's add some of that to it. Let's add some of our Red onion to it. And let's get that back side and add some celery and jalapeno. Not gonna use it all. Figure out something else to use with the rest of it here. Which won't be hard. We'll figure it out. So we got that. We got that in our delicious our boiled eggs. Give it a little stir. Uh Salt, kosher salt, fresh cracked pepper, uh, give 
leave that stir. And we will add our wet, obviously. Everything, you know, get that salt around there, get that pepper around there, get everything started anyway. Uh, Great pepper. You can use French's, use whatever you want. Don't use a lot. I mean, it depends on what you like as far as mustard flavor. I'd say a tablespoon. Then we're going to go with probably two tablespoons there. That's probably three. Let's say four. And we'll get this going in here. Get this incorporated. Then we'll taste it, see how it tastes here. Like I said, we went through the process of how you actually hard boil an egg to keep that greenness out of it, out of your yolk, that is. Which, uh, you know, it's cool. I mean, this obviously you know you can boil the eggs to whatever and make your deviled eggs like like that way, so you don't have the green in them. I mean, if you get the green in them, it's not the end of the world. This just looks a little better. All right, that's nice and incorporated. Let's take a taste. See how we did here, guys. It definitely doesn't need more, no more salt. It's perfect. It, it's spot on, uh, right the way it is right now. So there you have it. I'll make you a little sandwich next, and that'll be the thumbnail. But there you guys got it. Egg salad. Delicious egg salad. And we learned how to hard boil an egg without a yellow yolk. Oh, without a green yolk, excuse me. You know what I meant. And the genre's really coming through. Definitely use French's or whatever you want as far as your mustard. Spicy uh, brown mustard would work well on it too. It's totally up to you. Add what you want. Uh, take out the the jalapenos. A add what you want. Anyway, there you go. Alright guys, I thought I'd bring you back. We could uh, build a sandwich here quick. So here's our egg salad. Out. You want a lot of that eggy goodness. There we go. On this other half, well, we got some delicious iceberg lettuce. A couple slices of tomato, which I will give just a little bit of salt. Just tomatoes love salt and yeah, just a little bit of pepper. I always like to season stuff when I do stuff with sandwiches. So we go like that. Put our lid on like so. There's our sammy right there. Let's cut her in half. See how she looks. There you got it, guys. A delicious, I mean delicious, egg salad sandwich. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and do all that jive. We'll see you next week.